Hey guys, what's up? Rocky DJ is here, and today we'll be talking about a regular polygon and followed by line join method. <clears throat> so, since we spoke about the uh, creating a general uh, any kind of irregular polygon in the last few videos using the line command, I think it's time we uh, simplify the process by having a method that can create regular polygons. Like you have a pentagon, you have an hexagon with all uh, equal sides so those are your regular polygons and the way you create them is much pretty much the same as you create other shapes so over here I have uh, created something called variable triangle we can change this to whatever we want like let's say hexagon and what method we need to pass over here in the shape method uh, sh instead of shape would be regular polygon and before that I'll give a brief recap so we have a variable called stage over here which creates a stage a stage instance under the convo object and then <clears throat> we have a container uh, and the container uh, fills this division element over here with the ID container we have a script as usual in the HTML uh, zone we have a layer that we have created in which we don't pass any other arguments and then we have the final two statements which are pretty much necessary for this to work which are called uh, layer.add uh, triangle and stage.add layer since I'm using uh, using a, a triangle uh, instead of a triangle I'm using a hexagon over here I've replaced it with it and in this we need to fill our details so what you would say essentially would be uh, to start off it will be something like sides so let's say six sides because we are dealing with a hexagon and then you give a radius so let's give a radius of uh, about say 80 pixels and let's fill it with the color of uh, E05 alright so over here I made a simple mistake over here it's polygon instead of called geon so do not make these mistakes and as you can see we can see a uh, on an appearance over there and the reason it's not coming up is because we need to set uh, the center of this uh, hexagon in a right manner so as of now it is about 0 comma 0 so we can set it at 300 comma 300 so let's see what happens let me put a comma over there all right so as you can see you have a lovely hexagon over here with the fill e05 and the radius of 80 which means the center uh, center to the sides distance it has to be the perpendicular distance uh, so you can do that and then you can work around with this uh, in, in whatever way you want guys so uh, you can you, you can give the sides as 3 as uh, let's say as 4 as well and it'll create a rhombus or a square and then you can increase the radius to whatever value you would like to increase let's say 150 so that you have a bigger square over here so for now I'll put it at 6 sides and we will work with this so this is how you create a regular polygon very, fa very fast quite fast and easy you can give a stroke as usual and let's give a stroke of uh, about let's say we give a stroke of red Right, so as you can see, uh, you have a small uh, stroke appearing uh, over there. I'll increase the width of the stroke to about 30 pixels. Okay, so we can see that we have a very good shape over here, a uh, hexagon with a good stroke width and a stroke of red. Also, you can work with something called line join method, which I'll be expla explaining right now. And it's simple to use, it's, uh, it's called upon like this. So you have a line uh, join and then you have capital J over here. So what you do is you give a value, it can be mitre. So when I put mitre, nothing happens because mitre is the, uh, essentially it is the value whichever you're seeing over here. The lines are all joined in a sharp, crisp manner. Uh, another uh, thing that you have is bevel. So as you can see, if you, uh, if you take some notice over here, you can see beveling over there happening and this can be observed with a greater uh, thickness so as you can see we have beveled uh, edges over there that means that the sharp edges are cut off and this can be pretty useful in certain areas so in in, in, in case we have uh, three sides over here to deal with so you can see that it is performing a very nice job over there 
so that is how you can deal with the uh, various line join methods and there is another method the uh, last one it is round so as you can see our triangle right now has rounded edges and this can be useful as well when your when your requirements are so so as you can see if we have a hexagon with uh, rounded edges it looks like this and in case you want to go back to what it was you can put it as miter or altogether remove this line join so that it stays the same so default is the uh, miter option in this regard so you can go ahead and play around with this all right guys so this is the uh, video tutorial on regular polygons as well as line join method i suggest that you go ahead to js middle and start off working tweaking with our code and so that you can come up with various ideas of your own and share it with your friends and share your links the js fiddle links can be saved so share them for, so that i'll take a look and i'll give a nice comment over there also uh, subscribe to my channel and share my videos give a like to them if you like it and tell your friends about it so that they also start learning this amazing cool free open source framework all right guys this is rocket today signing off i'll see you in the next video tutorial thanks a lot for watching bye bye